Welcome to High Biz News. This is Kangsha Gangapuram, and you're watching National Business News. DHL Express, the world's leading international express service provider, is spreading the festive cheer again. Individuals can now send gifts and sweets internationally at a discount rate of at least 50% for the shipments weight more than 2 kgs. With the Diwali offer, DHL aims to help customers connecting with their friends and families worldwide. Sandeep Juneja, Vice President Sales and Marketing at DHL Express India, said the excitement of Diwali is even brighter and happier when we stay in touch with our loved ones. With the Diwali offers, we intended to bring a feeling of homes to those who are living miles away. With the hotel's door-to-door -door shipping and tracking options covering 220 countries and territories, we aim to be the trusted service partners for our customers. Customers can receive updates on the shipment status through an SMS or an email. <music> After an entertaining six-goal thriller in Pune, Hyderabad FC is back in action when they take on Marco Babel's North East United in what promises what yet to be another highest octane hero Indian Super League clash at the Indira Gandhi Athletic Stadium in Guwahati this Thursday. Hyderabad registered just a point from their opening clash against Mumbai City FC, while the Highlanders fell to a tough loss to Bengaluru FC and their first game of the season. The host North East United have added the likes of Mikhail Jacobsen, Romain Filiopotics, John Jatan's Naga and Mata Derbashir to an impressive core of Indian youngsters and proved a tough nut to the crack for Bengaluru who ran away with a narrow 1-0 win in the, that game. And HFC head coach Manolo Marquez believes that the Highlanders were unlucky to be on the losing end on that. The other day against BFS, I don't think they deserve to lose the game. It's just not just about the goal. I think North East played well with dangerous players like every season, Manolo added. <music> Institutional investments in Indian real estate touched USD 3.6 billion in January September 2022. Registering a hike of 18% YOY, the inflows during YTD were driven by the office sector, which accounted for 50% share, followed by the retail sector, which saw some large deals. While investors remain committed to the Indian market, the hovering global recreationary concerns can lead to the some delay in fund deployment. The office sector have seen a healthy recovery since the late last year with occupiers leasing larger space as now of offices are seen as place for the collaboration. Institutional investors are eyeing Greenfield and Ready Offices asset with large portfolios to bundle them up with as REITs in the future. Investments into the office sector rose 53% YOY during the first three quarters of 2022. The capital in India and real estate to getting more board based with active participation also from the domestic institutional and retail investors. Domestic capital is seen to flow across assets acquisition with credit in multiple asset classes with varied pool structures. The sentiment of the global investment firm to invest in India remains strong despite global slowdown trends. The current state of the economics to inflation and interest rate is not perceived to have long term impact, said Piyush Gupta, managing director, capital markets and investment services Colliers India. India's leading depository national securities depository limited NSDL has acquired a 5.6% stake in open network for the digital commerce or NDC that is 10 lakh equity shares of rupees 100 each NSDL invested an amount of rupees 10 crores on ONDC under the private placement route NSDL comments more than 89% of the market shares in terms of custody value was 4 trillion USD dollars. NSDL DMAT account holder are serviced through the depository participants from the 58,000 service center. NSDL's investors are presented in 99.2% of PIN codes in India and spread it across 189 countries. ONDC is an initiative to the Commerce Ministry to create an open public digital infrastructure. Experts believe ONDC is primed to do what NSDL has demonstrated in each security market, reach it out to the common man at the grassroots level through technology. This strategic deal will further strengthen the digital ecosystem to take digital e-commerce to the people of India, said Ms. Padmaja Chundru, MD and CEO NSDL.
This Diwali American Eagle India is bringing its Give Love Get Love donation led campaign by inspired customers. This campaign encourages customers to donate garments to American Eagle who in turn will donate them to the Clothes Box Foundation. The garments collected will then be refinished and distributed to those who most in needed of the essential clothing. For every donation made, customers will receive a special discount on their next AE jeans purchase. In 2021, American Eagle Give Love Get Love donation led camp collects over 5,000 garments. To participate, one needs to bring their garments to the nearest American Eagle store. Find the nearest American Eagle store. One can also visit in A.in to pledge the number of garments they wish to donate. A representative from the brand team will reach out to provide more details and answers any queries. To encourage this act of consolidation and giving, American Eagle will reward all the donations with a 20% off coupon for the customer's next AE jeans purchase. AU Small Finance Bank, the largest small finance bank and one of the fastest growing retail bank in India, has announced an increase in fixed deposit interest rate so that the customers can get maximum return on their investments. The bank has hiked the FD rates by up to 60 basis points for the retail deposits from the flagship of 6.9% to 7.5% for the regular customers and 7.4% to 8% for the senior citizens. With this hike, the bank is offering one of the most competitive FD interest rates. Given the rising inflation, AU Bank provides an opportunity for the customers, particularly senior citizens, to get inflation-beating returns for their fixed deposits. There is also an increase in the savings deposit rate by the 50 basic points in the balance buckets of Rs 1 CR or less than 2 crore, thereby it taking to a 6.5% PM. Moreover, the bank continues to offer a higher interest rate of 7% per annum for balance buckets for Rs 25 lakhs to less than 1 crore. Thank you for watching. Signing off. Keep watching Hybiz News.